What's up y'all, Sports Live in the ATL here in Atlanta. Damn, it's hotter than hell. But I love the weather, but it's still sweltering, man. You could you could melt some fried eggs, some ice cream on your body, man. It's just so damn hot here. But that's the that's the Georgia summer. Uh, making this video a couple topics. First of all, phone scammers. Now I'm starting to get the phone scammers again, goes without fail where I get these automated from overseas or wherever saying, you please make sure you call, you know, before we take legal action on you, blah, blah, blah. First of all, I've done nothing wrong. Number two, if somebody was going to come get you, they would just come get you. You know, kind of like Dog the Bounty Hunter or something like that. You know, they're not going to advertise it. And I feel like calling these people back and just letting them have it. Because anybody that replies to these people and actually gives them money is retarded. The government does not send you calls saying you're going to be arrested or legal action. This just does not happen. So these people, when they do this, it mind boggles me. Get a life. Get a real job. How about that? Real job. Anywho, Braves bullpen. Now, I know the Braves took two out of three from Detroit and are only a game back from the Phillies. Thank you, Dodgers. Dodgers are clearly the best team in baseball, in my opinion. I mean, clearly the best team in baseball. Uh... They made us and the Phillies look like ragdolls, literally speaking. Just pounded the crap out of both of us. And we're fighting for the divisional lead in the NL East. But the bullpen is atrocious. Every game that comes in, whether we win the game or not, they give up runs immediately. I mean, if it's, I mean the offense has to always add on runs because this bullpen is atrocious. And now, we, now we're able to sign either Keuchel or Kimbrell or anybody of significance. I mean, I would love to have either one of those two, former Brave uh, Kimbrell and or Dallas Keuchel. But we need to get some people in here who are going to help this bullpen out and help the offense out. I mean, you shouldn't be coming into the eighth inning with a three- or four-run lead, maybe an eight-run lead, and still win by four. I mean, against the Brewers, the bullpen, thank God a couple weeks ago we scored like 12 runs or something, or whatever it was, because the bullpen allowed seven runs in the last two innings. You know, the other day against Detroit, um, it was 3 nothing going into the 8th, I believe, and we won 4-3 to three on a game-winning, on a, on a go-ahead run, uh, run in the bottom of the 8th. So, so they didn't score anything through 7 innings, and in the 8th inning they scored 3 runs. Uh, I think a couple games before that we did the same thing. This bullpen is atrocious. You know, a few little good moments here and there, because the percentages say you're not going to suck all the time, but the starters need to go 9 innings right now and that's not going to happen it's not like the 90s or 80s or 90s where it happened all the time once the bullpen comes in i worry i worry every single time the bullpen comes in because the bullpen is just atrocious you know what you're going to get from the bullpen you know you're going to get runs that's one thing i can say i'm confident about i'm confident when the bullpen comes in we're going to give up runs and the offense is going to have to make sure they have a decent enough lead or uh the night that they are able to come back and score more runs because this bullpen's atrocious. Braves, you got to do something with it, man. Seriously, you need to do something with this bullpen now. If not, you might not make the playoffs. If you do, you're not getting out of the first round or the wild card or whatever. You're not. Not with this bullpen. Some people are saying it doesn't matter if you put the bullpen in there. They haven't pitched in a while. They're going to take a couple weeks. Well, that might be true, but you got to get them in here and get them, get them ready because they're better than what you got now. Some of these guys are not closers. Jackson, Webb, you know, admirable, yes, but they're probably more better for 7th and 8th. You know, just abominable. I mean, I can't, st uh, what's his name, Men a mentor or something with a W. Uh, it's just god-awful, man, just god-awful. So I'm praying to God that the Braves do something ASAP. Got the money. You don't got to give up a damn pick now. Just do it, man. Do it. Seriously. So but that's all I really want to say about that. Everybody have a great Monday. Uh, keep your head up. Do what you got to do. Uh, like Skin says, stay loyal. And uh, always be real, man. Always be real. Sleeta says, always be real. Okay? It's a doggy dog word out there. Always be real. You'll find your true friends you know, eventually. Always be real on YouTube, on the internet, and off. All right, and I'm out.